cancelled. Sweezy. Straight from Fox 5 New York's our friends over there, meaning I have no affiliation with them. Uh, Simone Biles offered coloring book mistaken for child on flight. A flight attendant apparently mistook seven-time Olympic medalist Simone Biles for a child and offered her a coloring book on a recent flight. The 25-year-old gymnast took to her Instagram story last week to share the embarrassing encounter. Not the flight attendant trying to give me a coloring book when I board. I said, no, I'm good, I'm 25, wrote Biles in the caption, which was shared on Twitter. Uh, Biles, who stands at 4 foot 8 inches, made a face in disbelief the ill illustrious athlete was possibly on a departure flight from her visit to the White House Thursday, where she received the Presidential Medal of Freedom. Today, she adds to her medal count, said President Joe Biden as he introduced Biles. The former foster child won 32 Olympic and World Championship medals, making her the most decorated U.S. gymnast in history. I don't know how you're going to find room for another medal, but Biden joked. Uh, the 25-year-old is an advocate for athletes, mental health, foster care children, and sexual assault victims. She also, the youngest person to ever receive the medal, said Biden. Uh, after the coloring book incident, another flight attendant offered Biles an alcoholic drink. The other flight attendant gave me a mimosa, so we're in the clear, she wrote. I'm like, that's good. So, like, you know, this, this is funny. This is just a funny misunderstanding. Like, I don't know. See, here's the thing. When, if someone mistakes you for a child, uh, you, you just, you know, you, you should feel flattered about that. That's the thing. You, you just feel flattered about it. I think before I really grew a beard, which, I don't know, some people are like, that's not a beard. I'm like, shut the fuck up. I'm, I'm working on it. Um, yeah, I used to, I, you know, I get car all the time. Now, now I'm like, I'll go buy alcohol. And if it's not a place like, you know, like Walmart, you know, like the big, you know, the big stores, uh, like, I never get car anymore, which is really surprising. And I'm also kind of worried because I was like, I feel like I still look good for my age. Like, you know, I'm just kind of fat, and that's the worst thing about it. Like, I think I still look pretty good for my age, but uh, I'm not getting carded in places anymore. Uh, and if I do, it's just kind of like routine, just kind of for everyone, like, to get carded. It's not like a big deal uh, in that sense of the word that, like, I'm just getting carded. It's just no big, not a big deal. Um, I like how one flight attendant asked for a coloring book, the other one... Uh, so, so, and so, you know, I like Simone Biles. I think she's great at what she does. And honestly, I'm kind of jealous that she's so young and uh, so successful at what she does. That's just like the jealousy in me. Um, so we move on here. Um, I know, I know, you can just like throw your kids on a plane that can fly across country, and they're like most kids are like they're just there's like the, there's like that age of kids, you know, and like they will like just be chill on a plane, just give them, like, an iPad or something, like, I'll be chill for, like, for the rest of my life, uh, and then there's, like, some kids who are just assholes, um, anyways, though, so, I always want to know the situation, because don't, like, isn't there, like, a whole thing you have to do when you, you let a child on an airplane alone, isn't that, like, a rule, is there a rule there, and also, 4-8, that looks like a 13-year-old, dude, and I don't, like, that's, like, a 13-year-old could be 4'8". Clearly, a grown woman can also be 4'8". That's not, like, a surprise either. Like, isn't, isn't, you know, aren't you, um, that, and then, like, just, like, I can show you my ID, and, like, legal, and then, like, is that ID real or fake? I don't know, but, anyways, though, um, good deal. And also, I know some adults who would try, who would take a coloring book if they had nothing to do on a flight, and I do, and this is off topic, though, but, I always get annoyed with people who get annoyed with, like, babies and shit on a flight. You know, like, the babies, like, you know, when they're, like, toddlers, like, the parents would be like, don't fucking mess with anyone or I will scare you to death or something like that. You know, like, the, don't kick someone the back of someone's fucking seat. Don't annoy them, you know, stuff like that. But, like, babies, they don't know. Like, their ears are popping. They don't know what the fuck is going on. They're crying. They're like, oh, God, this baby's making noise. I'm like, bring fucking headphones on a flight. You know, bring headphones on a flight because that blocks out every other fucking thing on the plane. And, you know, uh, because babies are going to be their way. Uh, you have a little bit more control over toddlers, but uh, ba babies you can't do anything about. Um, all right, well, that's gone way off topic. Uh, anyways, though, she could have got a coloring book and a mimosa. Let's just think about that here. Simone Kyles, Simone, Simone Kyles, Simone Biles could have had both. And, uh... Imagine getting offered a coloring book and a mimosa on the same flight. That'd actually be kind of cool. 
That would be kind of cool. Let's uh, do that. Let's drink to that. Let's drink to Simone Biles. Here's feeling. Oh, I don't think I can say the Seinfeld one. I think I have to do this one now. Hey there, you just checked out a highlight from Cancel Sweezy. Thank you very much. I'm glad that you learned something and that you are now a smarter individual. Uh, just so you know, we have full episodes and other many, many highlights available now. Uh, click here for the next best thing that you can go check out as well. And uh, make sure you press that subscribe button and press that notification bell. That way you get updated anytime we make a new post or any time that we make a new highlight or full episode. So thank you, honk if you love butt drugs, and stay awesome.